Good evening, I'm Jake Wozikowski in for Jennifer Griswold tonight. Now it's six. The first positive case of the coronavirus in Nebraska. The patient is a 36 year old woman who is traveling abroad. Reporter John Kipper is live at UNMC with the latest on the situation. John. Yeah, Jake, right now the shot you see is at UNMC right now where we're expected uh, to get the patient at any time. Here is what we absolutely do know at this time. Uh, a 36 year old woman recently returned from the United Kingdom and just yesterday went to a Methodist Hospital in Omaha where she reported respiratory issues that she's been having for the last 12 days. It was confirmed the day that she did test positive for the coronavirus and is seriously ill. And so it was announced that she will be headed to the biocontainment unit. Now they're checking to see who she might have been in contact with and exactly where she's been since she's been back into Nebraska, because according to Governor Pete Ricketts, it matters quite a bit. For example, if she was already symptomatic and was staying home the entire time, then obviously there's a lot less risk than if she was going to work. And was one of the reasons why we tell people, if you're sick, stay home. We just don't know those answers to the questions right now. Now, Ricketts did say that he is hoping that Nebraska is going to be the best prepared state in the entire country for this coronavirus, and that he also did recommend that people continue to do things like elbow bumping instead of handshakes, uh, especially now that we do have a confirmed case in Nebraska. That's all we have for you now. If we do learn anything more, Jake, we'll be sure to let you know.